what motivated me was the fact that I thought I could actually do it for the first time, so it just made me work extra hard to actually achieve that grade. Teachers also helped, like, because they pushed you to try and get the better grades. I think what motivated me was when Miss entered me into the A-Star project and I thought, OK, maybe I'm actually capable of doing something. What motivated me to get that grade is visualising where I wanted to be in a certain time. So I visualised myself in in one of the one of the best universities in, in the UK. Fearing failing again after failing the first time and you know, not wanting to do as badly as last year. Um, as it got nearer to the exam, I got a lot more focused in class and then outside of school I would print off past papers and do them and make loads of notes and just get everything I needed to remember down. Firstly, I made sure that I revised for every test that I had, whether it be a small learning table test or a test that wasn't tracked, uh, like it was a mock, so I took it as seriously as it was a mock exam, made revision notes so that by the end of the year, when it came up to the real exams, I had all these revision notes ready and I had a much better understanding. Um, before the exam, I started revising with my friends that were in higher sets and see what they said and also bought revision guides and just read through them over and over again. Um, uh, revising a lot, uh, using teachers as a resource, um, going back after school. Uh, in philosophy I did lunchtime revision sessions uh, every Wednesday from around the end of February up until the exams, just before my lessons. Um, how I did it is um, early revision, I think that's key. So I started revision around January, February time, uh, and seeing the exams are in May, June, I think um, that's the ideal time to start revision. And I started going to the library around April time, May time, so that's the exam times. And I was surrounded by people that were equally working as hard as me. And and they all had like kind of similar dreams and goals. So like three A stars, and the three A's are more like those top unis that you can get into. Um, probably after my mock exams, because uh, I was predicted four Bs, and I got four Bs in my mocks, but I wanted A's. So. When I got a D in my Germany paper, and I realised that I need to like focus on that and get better. Um, what changed was when I got a D in one of my mocks, and I thought that I, I wanted to do better than get just a D in the actual exam. I had a target grade of a B and I wanted to make sure that I knew that I could do better than that so I aimed to go above and beyond that B, made sure that I, because I knew I could get an A, I tried hard to get that A rather than just settling for a B.